Okay, let's begin. Betsaida is here. Thank you so much for being here. Good evening. Also, we have Sandra and Erika and Roxana. Thank you so much, everybody. It's nice to have you one more time. We're going to have our Hello. last class. Welcome. How are you? Hello, teacher. Le puedo pedir permiso de estar solo de oyente un momento que ahorita voy saliendo de trabajar. What is your name? What is your name? Hola. Yes, what is your name? What is your name? Oh, Sandra? Sandra? Yes? <laughs> okay. No. Yes, Sandra. Yes. No problem. No problem, Sandra. Sandra. Yes. No problem. Thank you so much. Es que, es que estaba chequeando something here, entonces, um, I didn't. Okay. Teacher. Oh, yes. Uh, can you give me a few minutes, please? <laughs> oh, sure. And, and I, uh, I, want, I want to tell you something. Okay. And, and I try to do in English. Oh, sure. <laughs> Go ahead. Okay. Uh, I, uh, I want to say you thank you very much. Oh, that's very for, nice of you. <laughs> for oh, uh, uh, so uh, uh, everything uh, in English. And, and for that, I I say thank you. And uh, I seen I we are um, learn very much. Uh, uh, <laughs> and and uh, Y por eso me, me, me siento profundamente agradecida. Eh, usted ha, ha hecho que lo difícil lo sintamos fácil y siempre nos ha impulsado a, a que estemos y estemos aprendiendo. Oh, that's eh, very really, nice. Really, I, I learned very so much. Okay. Oh, I, I <laughs> I really appreciate that. I really appreciate that, Roxana. Thank you. You're so nice and sweet. Oh, okay, it's, God, it's... God bless you. Oh, thank you so much. Life, every you're day. So nice. Oh, you're so nice. Thank you so much um, for letting me know that. That, uh, that, makes, that means to me a lot. Okay. Um, so uh, thank you so much for letting me know. That means a lot. To me. Um, and again, as I told you, uh, como usted mencionó, right? Um, uh, I would like to say, uh, I try to motivate people so you can uh, improve. I know learning English is not easy, right? Entonces, uh, I try to do it. Also, uh, that's why I would like to tell you, uh, go to get the visa, right? Y nos vemos in New York. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> go request the visa, right? So you, we can we can we can uh, go to New York, right? And we can practice English over there. Yes, you see, All right? Yeah. So uh, <laughs> yes, keep keep learning. Oh, that's very nice of you. You made my day today. See, you made so dia. You made my day today, Hi. and that's that's wonderful. I really appreciate that, right? Okay. Yes, and 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 don't forget that this thing learning English. It, it's not a piece of cake, right? It's not semita alta with coffee. It's, it's a process. It's little by little. Practice yeah. every single day. day. Uh, use the phrases. Use the phrases with your family. Cuando se levante, diga, ah, good morning. How are you? It's nine o'clock. I want to have breakfast. Where is my breakfast? Okay, so practice uh, little by little, right? Introduce your relatives. Oh, this is my husband. His name is George, right? He's 25 and he lives in <laughs> the United yes. States. Okay. Yes. Yeah. So yes. I I try I try to do that in, in my house. Oh, that's <laughs> very good. Créeme que a veces um llega un momento que ya no los da pena. Yes. <laughs> sí. Yeah, llega un momento que ya no los da pena. We don't care about uh, about something else and that's the way we do it. Thank you so much. 
Okay. Thank you so much, Rosana. I love it. We're going to have vocab and review practice for today. Okay. We're going to have a little bit of quantifiers. Okay. So uh, let's listen and watch. This time we'll talk about quantifiers. When we don't know the exact percentage of something, we use words like some, most, a few. Stay and learn more quantifiers and how to use them. Quantifiers. All families have only one child. Nearly all families have only one child. Most families have only one child. Many families are smaller these days. A lot of families are smaller these days. Some families are smaller these days. Not many couples have more than one child. A few couples have more than one child. Few couples have more than one child. No one gets married before the age of 18. Notice how these quantifiers have an estimated percentage. If you want to make reference to 100%, you may say all, and then you work down the scale depending on the percentage you want to refer to. Follow me in this example. Nearly all women work nowadays. Nearly all, quantifier. Women, plural noun. So in other words, all quantifiers come before plural nouns, except no one. No one gets married before the age of 18. No one, quantifier, gets the verb. As a tip, ask your teacher to remind you about count nouns so you are able to use these quantifiers. Type in two examples using any quantifier you want. We're gonna have a little bit of this thing that are called quantifiers in English. Okay, so what is this thing about? Pretty much to talk about quantities. Yes, quantities from zero to 100. Yes, so I can communicate the quantity of something. For example, use a lot of, all, few, nearly all before plural nouns. So, plural nouns, okay? In English, as you may know, tenemos plurales, right? Plural nouns, yes? Y tenemos also um, singular nouns, yes? Ahora, si usted se fija, estos, a lot of, all, few, nearly all, Van siempre, right? Antes de un plural noun. Okay? A lot of, all, few, nearly all. Families are small. Okay? Entonces, si la palabra es plural, antes vamos a poner cualquiera de estas palabras que están acá. Right? Yes. Y aquí podemos ver el porcentaje, right, de lo que queremos comunicar. All, 100%. Nearly all, 90%. Must, yes, and so on and so on. Right? Ahora, aquí tenemos also, use no one before verbs. Aquí está el verbs, right? No one gets married before the age of 18. Yes. So, cuando vamos a ocupar no one, yes, no one, yes, uh, vamos a ocuparlo siempre antes del verb y estos antes de la, un plural. Esta palabra nearly all means almost all. Ok, entonces en algunas ocasiones usted va a ver esta palabra almost all the people, I don't know. Work on No one se usa en cuando es singular también. Oh, no, en este contexto, 
eh, es singular. Esta palabra es singular siempre. Ajá, en no one siempre va a ser con singular. En el contexto de acá, right? Ah. Sí, ahora este verbo siempre va a ir la mayoría de veces es. Right? Uh -huh. No one gets. Ahora, claro, el contexto se está refiriendo a todos. ¿Ya? Yeah? Right? Uh -huh. Se está uh -huh. refiriendo a todos. So that means that si usted dice, no one gets married before the age of 18. I mean, si usted se fija, el verbo lleva una S. El AS lo ocupamos con terceras personas, right? Sí. He, she, and it. Entonces, como tiene S, usted puede decir, ah, pero es singular porque tiene S. But, eh, si no, no, como esta palabra es singular, uh -huh. tengo que ponerle una S a Calvert. Sí. Pero el contexto está refiriendo a todos, ¿ya? Yeah? Everybody. A todos ellos, a todos e ellos. Exact. Very good. Exact. Great okay. job. Okay. So, let's have read the sentences about the small town in Monroe. Rewrite the sentence. The quantifiers in the box. Aquí tenemos los quantifiers. A lot of, all, few, nearly all. En no one. ¿Y qué tenemos en las sentences? Bueno, tenemos numbers, right? Si usted se fija, mire. 100, 98, 89, 23. What are we going to do? Esos numbers los vamos a cambiar y vamos a utilizar one of these ones. Yes. Vamos a utilizar this vocabulary in here. For example, in more row, no one drives before the age of 16. Okay. ¿Cómo nos quedaría el number two? Let's take a look. Mm -hmm. Vamos a ir a la tablita, right? And here we can check cuál de todos estos tiene como un 98%. Nearly all. Oh, very good. Thank you so much. Right? Entonces vengo yo y digo, oh, Bravo. Ok, let me see. Nearly, very good. Los que están aquí, right? Nearly. Los que están aquí. Nearly. Ah. All. What is next? Percent. Eh, eh, no, ya no voy a escribir percent porque percent es parte del nombre. Ups, ups. Of. Exactly. Of the students. The students. Voy a agregarle eso. Da. The students. Finish high school. Okay, finish. Very good. High. Oh, my gosh. High school. Yay. All right. Yes. Okay. ¿Para qué me sirven estas palabritas? Bueno, para no decir un porcentage, para no decir una quantity. Yes. Para no ser specific about it. Pero en cierta forma, si estoy diciendo una cantidad big or small. Yes. So if I say nearly all, pues casi todos, right? Of the students finish high school. Yes. Thank you. Karen. Next one, Karen. Number three. Hello, Karen. Is Karen here? Karen, no, she's busy probably. Hector, thank you, Hector. Good evening. It's nice to have you. Good evening, teacher. Nice uh, hair, by the way. Number three. A lot of. Okay. Eight. Mm. If you see, we have 100. 100%. Uh, 100%. Uh, uh huh. Ah, oh, uh, yeah, few. Oh, no, I'm sorry. No, Hector, look at look at this one, uh, the scale. Here, look at the scale. Ah, uh, all. Uh, oh. Exactly, very good. Okay. Es que no había leído bien los demás. Yo creí que estaban en 99 y todo eso. Okay, okay. All, very good. Children. Of children. Sí, creo que aquí me equivoqué. Aquí. Aquí no necesita este of. I'm sorry. Okay. No necesita love. Igual aquí en esta no necesita all. 
All children. Uh, children. All the children. All the children. Star school. Start. Very good. School. By the age of six. Exactly. Very good. Of six. Look at this one, right? Yes. All these children start school by the age of six. Yep. All the children start school by the age of six. Thank you so much. Very good, Hector. Okay. Volunteers for the next one. Number four. Thank you. Volunteers. Mom? Excuse me. Okay. Okay. So, Moss. Okay, Moss. The couples. Couples, okay. Have more than one child. Okay, very good. Okay, also, I'm thinking about here, for example, we don't need this one here. Okay, also, we don't need this one here. Jesus Christ, I love it. Mm -hmm. Nearly all the students, oh, yes, makes sense. All children start school by, yes. Most couples have more than one child. Yep, beautiful. And the last one, number five. Brenda, thank you. Uh, not many. Very good. Continue. Not many families had but more oh, like, than um, four children. Thank you so no. much, Brenda. Wonderful. Yes. Thank you. Es que aquí ya no se ve mucho, right? Yes. Not many families have more than four children. Yay, that is correct. Very good. Yes. Pero, yes, pero, uh, creo, okay, correct me if I'm wrong, que teníamos que ocupar esta que está acá, right? Esta de acá. <laughs> like, for example, Aquí tenemos nearly all en la number two, en la number four, number three tenemos all, yes. Um, pero en esta, en esta, right? Sí, en la number four, probablemente sería a lot of. O a few. Oh, no, porque few sería este de acá, right? Uh -huh. Few is like 20, I guess. Yeah. Yes. Pero si nos vamos a la tabla, si usted se fija la tabla, right? Si es de 80, 89%. Y aquí solo tenemos a lot of. Um, y según la tabla, mira, está como en 50, right? Mm -hmm. yes. So. No, 89. 89. Yeah, it's like, it's like here, right? Like moss. Uh-huh. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I don't know why. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. A lot of a lot of children start school by the age of six. Okay. I think I think um I'm sorry, this one is correct, like most eighty percent. A lot of yeah. Yeah, this one is correct. Most couples have more than one child, and this one also not many families have more than four children. Yeah, I I mean, both of them are correct. Both of them are correct. Yeah, so you, I, I don't I don't I don't see a mistake on that one. Because of the scale that we have here. If you see the scale here is quite the same. Yeah, so the percentage is like 20. This one is like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Oh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Oh Jesus, I'm missing one. That's why maybe I kiss you a few, right? 
view. Okay, here, view. Yeah, if you want to write it like that. Yeah, so um, I think both of them are correct. Just gonna this the here, like mass couple, mass couple, which is uh, this one, right? This one is correct. But aquí in this chart, tenemos a lot of. And I don't know why we have a lot of here. Should be here. Yes. Um, also, one more time. El según este thing here, pues antes de una palabra, plural, right? Entonces, por eso siempre tenemos, pues, una palabra plural. Yes, very good. Y esta, que va antes del verb. Yep. Um, Oh, wow. Exactly, exactly. Very good. Let me check the next exercise. Give me a minute. Jesus Christ. Oh, look at this one. I love this one. Let's take a look. Um, We have this information. This is like a survey, right? Rewrite the sentence. 90% of children go to public school 10% of children go to private school. If you see here, we have the... Oh, Jesus Christ. ¿Cómo se le llama esta cosa? Uh, el, uh, el diagrama de pastel. Exactly. Exactly. But I don't know how to say diagram. But is it, I don't know. Yeah. Give me a minute. Es um, un cake. <laughs> I don't cake. think so. <laughs> un cupcake. <laughs> no, okay. cupcake. That's why, right. por eso estaba pensando, right? Es que, a Jesus, no, no sé cómo decir eso en inglés. That's why. Um, <laughs> I think it's not a cake. But it's a cake, but it's not a cake. Um, <laughs> okay, let me see. Puede hacer que se diga cake diagram. Sí. Oh. No, no. Dice, a cake diagram is a map image of an area to be mapped with lines drawn. Okay. Yeah, I don't think... Yes or no? That's what I'm... Um... Okay, give me the um... I don't know. I'm sorry. <laughs> I don't know how to say this. Uh, teacher. Yes. Is a uh, como no sé cómo se pronuncia. Venn diagram. Excuse me. Sí, diagram. Diagram. Uh, Venn. Diagram, no sé cómo se produce el diagram. Oh, diagram, diagram. Diagram. Ajá. Uh -huh. Es como oh. así. Eh, very good. Mire, ok, very good. Corrija, we have a circular. Aquí me aparece circular en pi, pi diagram. ¿Ese me está diciendo usted? Uh, no. Uh, así. Sí, uh, pero eso es círculo de pastel. Pi, pi, like, like this one, eh, Brenda. Circle passer. A mí me parece decir, pi, uh, oh, Jesus. Pi diagram. Es diagrama de pastel, teacher. Yes. No, pero me parece <laughs> pi. Y pastel es cake, right, Roxana? Cake. Pues so, sí, pero de, <laughs> así se llama. <laughs> yeah. Ok. O también me parecía circular. Okay. Uh -huh. Ajá, eh, es conocido como diagrama oh. de pastel o diagrama circular. Oh, yes, very good. Teacher. Ajá. Uh -huh. uh, yo, yo le pregunté a mi esposo, él ha uh -huh. nacido en Canadá y él me dijo que se dice Ben Así como lo escribí, pero hay diagrama. Diagrama. Oh, espérame, espérame, espérame. Pero no sé si será correcto. Oh, yes. ¿Qué me menos? Uh -huh. Petrelo. Yes, that is correct. Petrelo. Yeah, very good. Mire, no, hombre, si todos los días aprendemos something else, right? Yeah, Bien. very good. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Yes. Este, este es el más técnico de los tres. 
Yes, de los tres. With este es el M, with M. No, doble N. Al final. No. Al final. No se pronuncia. Diagram. Diagram. Oh, yes. Thank you so much. Very good. Diagram. <laughs> It's Venn diagram. Venn diagram. Venn yeah. diagram. Pi diagram. diagram, circular diagram, and we have Venn diagram. Este es el último, es el más técnico de los tres, right? Very good. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Brenda. <laughs> Thank you, Brenda. Barba, ¿cómo diría, Picho? <laughs> oh, Jesus. El de Barba. Jesus, Arely. That's the first one. <laughs> No. Es que hay de barra, de barra, yes. de barra. Hay de barras, right? But, eh, es que, mira, en, en, ahora no si les dije en algún momento, cuando no ocupamos un vocabulary, pues se nos olvida, ¿ves? Entonces, este tipo de cosas, I don't, I don't okay. use these ones, right? No, no los ocupo, entonces, como no los ocupo, son yeah, palabras so, técnicas. Exactly, es la like vegetables, right? Si no comemos los vegetables, pues, okay. después no nos gusta. We don't like them. We don't like them, right? Okay. Thank you so much, Brenda. That's very nice. That's very nice mm -hmm. of you. Okay, so we're going to have, we're going to rewrite the sentence. Yes, you, like, like this one. Few children go to private schools. Okay. Yeah, very good. Children. Go to... Private. Right. Very good. School. Yes. Right. Very good. So what are we doing is we are using this one, right? Because it's 10% children go to private school. Okay. Yes. Very good. A great job. Erika, the next one is for you. Be ready. Be ready. Okay. Hello. Thank you so much. It's a Venn diagram. It's a Venn diagram. What <laughs> people do after they finish high school? Oh, look at this one. Three options. Mire. Go to college, look for uh, work, or there. And we have 62% of young people go to college after they finish high school. 34% of young people look for work. So, ¿cómo nos quedaría la number one? It's just many. Many people Many people go, go to college. Okay. Okay, Absolutely. young, don't forget young people mm -hmm. go to college, okay, after you tell me they finish high okay. school. Some... Okay, very good. And what about the other sentence? Yeah, 30% is uh, some young people. Go to some young people, yes. Is look look for work for work. Very good. Okay. Thank you so much. Right. So here we have some young people look for work. And many young people go to college after this finish high school. No, sounds pretty good. Not this is not for Miss Havilah, right? Yeah, absolutely not. That's a different reality. Yeah, absolutely. I'm sorry about it. That's sad, right? Yeah. Um, when it comes to education, uh, oh my gosh! When it comes to education, we are like like. Yeah, la selecta cuscatleca. That's what I think when it comes to education here in our country. La selecta cuscatleca. Okay, I'm sorry about it. Yes, I hope that we can improve uh, this part. Okay, because it's not good. Okay, let's carry on. The next one is 90%. Are you there, please, lady? Thank you. The information and then give me the examples. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. 
95. Mm. Percent. Not many color. Primero todo. Uh, yes, that is correct. Okay, okay. 95% of people over 65 like to talk to family and friends. 43% of people over 65 like to spend time on a hobby. 3% of people over 65 like to play soccer. Now, now tell me the sentence, please. What people? What people 65 um older do? Talking 95% Percent. Person. Um, a hobby 43% Percent. Percent. Soccer 3% Percent. Percent. Very good. Percent. Yes. So we have not many, not many. Not many? Mm -hmm. Of people? Continue. Over 65 likes to talk of to family and friends? Oh, here we have 95. Um, y agregado también en la... No, what happened is, what is the meaning of no many? A lot of and nearly all. Ah, ¿en cuál de las tres? Mm -hmm. um... Like you need to see the percentage, right? The percentage here is 95. Talking. Mm -hmm. Percent. A hobby, 43%. Percent. And oh, okay. soccer is 3%. Percent. So... Not many. Which one is the correct one? Talking, a hobby, or soccer? Um, sería soccer. Oh, okay. Right. So you need to... Now you have it, lady. Very good. Tell me, please. Not many? No, many... Um... <laughs> Uh, the how many uh, oh, not, not people? Many, not many. many people. Very good. Uh, not many people. Uh, over. Agregaría el porcentaje del tres. No, I'm o sorry. O sería que está arriba sesenta y cinco. No, I'm sorry. Just the age. Just the age. Sixty-five. Okay. Mm -hmm. Like to play soccer. Exactly. Very good. Perfect. Yes, very good, right? Not many people have a 65 light to play. Oh, yes. Play. Play. That's what it is. Okay, play soccer. Very good. Thank you, lady. What about the next one? A lot of. Um, so that means just two yeah. options are left. Talking. Or a hobby. Okay. Okay. What is the Porque meaning a lot of? of uh, mucho. Exactly. In nearly all. Uh -huh. I se me olvidado en la de cuál. Lo que significa. A lot of. A lot of es mucho. Nearly all es casi todos. Ah, okay. Ah, entonces sería nearly entonces, all. Diga. Habits. Habits. Buenas noches. Nearly all. Sí, doña Cris. Uh, nearly all, ajá. Uh -huh. um, nearly all people over 65 like to talk to family and friends. Me está hablando de los distintos. Yes, very good. Thank you. What about the other one? What about the other one? Uh, a lot of people over 65 are to spend time on a hobby.
Thank you. Uh, a lot of people love a 65 out of spend time. Yeah, very good. Perfect. Wonderful. Yes. Thank you so much. Okay. Very good. So, um, yes. Any question about this? No questions? Okie dokie. Let me show you the next one. Here we go. Okay. Oh, Jesus Christ. Okay. Give me a minute. I need to take the attendance. Se me fue el tiempo, mira. Jesus, qué rápido pasa el time, right? Okay, I'm sorry about it. Uh, here we go. Let's take a look. Um, Please, when you hear your beautiful name, say present or I'm here. Okay. Um, Ana Maria Emily Guevara. Present teacher. Nice to have you and welcome. Arely Janet Cornejo Rivas. Present teacher. Nice to have you and welcome. But say that Jasmine Berrios Menjivar. Present teacher. Thank you so much and welcome. Brenda Cecilia Mejia Ayala. Present. Thank you so much and welcome. Cynthia Rachel Bonilla Valiente. Hello, Cynthia. Are you here? Let me check Cynthia. Okay, Cyn. No, she isn't here. No, she isn't. Okay. Oh, what about Elizabeth Yasmin Cañas Alvarenga? Present teacher. Good evening and nice to have you. Erika Lisette Garcia Acosta. Present. Nice to have you. Um, Germán Ulises Pinto Sánchez. Hello, Germán. No, he isn't. Let me see if Germán is here. Because he doesn't answer. Because sometimes, like, you're busy at home, but you're just listening. Yeah, Herman, thank you so much. We got you here. Just give me a minute. Okay. Um, Griselda Saray Lara Menjibar. Present, teacher. Thank you. Good evening. Hector Enrique Guzman Alvarado. Present, teacher. Thank you. Ingrid Stephanie Sosa Deras. Present. Nice to have you. Jacqueline Andrea Orellana Galdames. Present. Good evening and welcome. Jessica Maria Molina de Olmedo. Present, teacher. Thank you so much and welcome. Juan Carlos Escobar Valle. Present, teacher. Thank you. It's nice to have you, Juan Carlos. Judith del Carmen Alfaro Rodriguez. Present, teacher. Thank you and welcome. Karen Stephanie Carvajal Rivas. Present. Yeah, Bye. sorry. Teacher. <laughs> yeah, primero tenía problemas con el micrófono. <laughs> Entonces no podía responder cuando me estaba preguntando. Oh, thank you so much. <laughs> no problem. Nice to have you. One okay. more time. Lady Evelyn Guerrero Perez. Present, teacher. Thank you so much. Young lady, Luis Ernesto Garcia Fuentes. Present teacher. Thank you, Liz. It's nice to have you. Moises Elias Martinez Flores. Hello, Moises. No, he isn't. Okay. What about Roxana Yanira de La Paz Artola de Funes? Present teacher. Thank you so much and welcome. Sandra Marixa Violantes de Arevalo. Present teacher. Thank you so much. It's nice to have you. Silvia Vexali Manzanares Rivas. In the chat, oh, it, oh, let me check. Thank you so much for letting me know. Oh, because I don't, I don't see the chat here. Chat. Okay. Sylvia and also Luis. Thank you so much. Very good. Um, Jancy. I'm here, teacher. Thank you so much. And the last one is going to be Jessica del Carmen Rivas Andino. Okay, just give, let me give me a minute. Just let me double check. Oh, 
Okay. Sorry about it. Okay. Just need to check something here really quick. Yep, here we go. Oh, Jesus Christ, where is this thing? Yep, okay. Uh, we're going to have another one here. Complete these sentences about... Oh, look at this one. About your country, El Salvador. Oh, Jesus Christ, this is not going to be good. Okay. Thank you. <laughs> Roxana, number one. Okay. All young people go to college. Ah. <laughs> no, <laughs> to no. College. Think about think about El Salvador and pick one of these quantifiers for us. Okay, college um some young people go to college. Okay. Very good. So we have son. You know what is the difference between college and university, right? Yes. ¿Saben cuál es la diferencia entre college and university? El, el college es como el bachillerato. Exactly. In the United States, el college es como el es, right? Uh -huh. Es como el, el, um, el bachillerato. También hay, hay carreras técnicas, right? En el college. Yes. En la university, pues es university. Right, where you have a, a major, yes, a degree on something. Uh -huh. Erika? Son como técnicos, el college. ¿Y el high school? ¿Qué es? Oh, bachillerato. ¿Y el sí. college? Ah, el college es como un técnico, entonces. Exacto. Sí, el, el college, college es como, es como ah. un técnico. Uh -huh. Es ah. como un técnico, yes. Muy entonces, bien. like, like here en El Salvador, pues, no tenemos college, vamos de un solo al high school, right, Erika? Y, y luego pues a la university. Yes. Okay. In the United States, tienen estas options. Like here in El Salvador, pro probably los que tenemos son elitka, I guess, right? Eh, also, ¿Sí? creo que eh, El... Ricardone o Don, no, Don Bosco, creo que es another one, right? Exal. El, 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 el ITI también. ITI, Instituto Técnico Industrial. Y, y todos los que son como a nivel de regionales también, que dan técnicos, por uh -huh. ejemplo, el, el, el Megatet, los Megatet. Exacto, los Megatet, hay una en Chalate, Los Megatet right? eh, hay en Occidente, uh -huh. para Central, That Oriente. Is That is correct. Entonces. Teacher, um... ¿y cuando hablan de preparatoria? Oh. Es bachillerato. También. Sí, el no. bachillerato. No, el bachillerato. No, la secondary school es, 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 es el, el third cycle. Third cycle que tenemos aquí en El Salvador. Tercer ciclo. Ah, yes. uh -huh. Pero es que allá como que la secundaria llega hasta como al nueve. Como al diez. Al nueve le llaman. Después el high school comienza a diez, once y doce. Exacto, exacto. Mm. Como que, como que tienen un montón de cosas allá, right? I think. They have a lot of, they spend a lot of money. Por eso la estructura del money, right, in the U.S. No sé si han visto ustedes studies or, or news. Cómo se endeuda la gente cuando está estudiando, right? Sí. Like, uh -huh. eh, por el mismo process que ellos tienen. Sí, entonces al final termina, like, endeudado, like heavy. Yeah, with, with, with this one. Y es... el... Estudian para poder pagar esa deuda después. Exactly, exactly, sí. right. Entonces, uh, así es el sistema que tiene. El sistema that, that is over there is about money. Todo yes. is about money. Money, 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 right? So uh, that is, that is, that is like, I don't know, advantage and disadvantages, right? That we can have. Okay. Some Pero people... con la diferencia que son bien remunerados después. Exactly. That is correct. <laughs> Recuperan muy bien la inversión. Inclusive, right? Inclusive. Uh -huh. um, por eso, I, I mean, mucha gente se va por allá, right? Just to get a, no. a money. 
A mí, no, yo, sí. te, yo tengo sobrinos que han nacido y viven allá y pues, híjole, han tenido buenas oportunidades. Exacto. Son profesionales y uh, ganan muy bien. <ríe> y y <ríe> nosotros, que según <ríe> <Mister Lee. ríe> mire, <ríe> oiga, y nosotros aquí nos quemamos las pestañas y, <ríe> y, <nada. ríe> y seguimos ganando colones <ríe> no, y ya, 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 me, ya me deprimió de la vida. <ríe> No, ¿sabes lo que dijo Arelis? Y somehow is sad. Porque lo que uno que gana aquí en un año, allá se lo ganan en un mes. A mí. ¿Ya? Yeah. Sí, 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 le cuento un, una historia. <ríe> es, este, hace poco le salieron los papeles a un familiar, un primo hermano. Por eso uh, mi primo no tiene mayor nivel de estudio, ¿verdad? pero va yes. con papeles de residencia. Uh -huh. Y me llama un día bien contento, hace como unas dos semanas, y me dice, prima, me dice, mire, Aquí estoy ganando 130 dólares al día, me dijo. Y allá me pagaban 10 dólares. Y bien, y bien trabajado. ¿verdad? Trabajado. Y yo le digo, te vas a volver un millonario. ¿le? Siempre le dicen a uno, no hombre, cuando llegue allá te mando para los zapatos. ¿verdad? Y nada. No, lo que pasa es que ya no te Mire, pizza, tienen que pagar la renta es cara, la comida es cara, todo es caro, pues como así ganan. Exactly. Como everything is about money, right? Everything is about money. Entonces, ok. Thank you. I'm sorry about it. Ok. I'm sorry. Jancy, number two. People study English. What about this one? Your microphone, Jancy, I'm sorry. Your microphone, your microphone, Jancy. Oh, su microphone, no lo puede encender, okay. No, okay, I'm sorry. Okay, let's work with Karen. Thank you, Karen. People study English. Mm -hmm. Like all, a lot of, few, most, nearly all. <laughs> no one. Okay. In the United States or in El no, Salvador? No, this is our country. Our country, El Salvador. Uh, okay. This is about El Salvador. This is your country, right? Mm -hmm. So that means El Salvador. El Pulgarcito. <laughs> El Quedamos atrás. Andrea Song, people mm. should <laughs> Karen, bueno, what do you think? Uh, I, sí, es que yo no se puede usar son, yeah, porque o sea, algunos. Yeah, que no, yeah, you can use yeah. it. Yeah. Ajá. Mm -hmm. uh, uh -huh. Que siente que no. Yeah, some, some, mm -hmm. yeah, some people. Uh, remember that studying English is not easy, right? It's expensive. Uh, pretty much it's expensive. If you yeah. notice, you are here studying y está gastando internet connection. Yes. Right, uh, an electronic device. That means a computer, a cell phone, or a tablet, whatever you're using, right? So that means it's expensive and, and not, I think it's, it's not like, not all of us, I mean, have the chance to study. There is a big difference. I mean, a big difference. Aquí in the city, usted lo puede notar, right? So you can have access to internet. Pero en los pueblos, en los cantones, uh, Jesus Christ. Donde no llega nada, right? Donde aquí en San Salvador cancelan las clases y allá, right, en el cantón. Aquí nos aplica el AL para hacer los niños. <laughs> en yes. el tercero. Ah, yes. Mary, who's the more is that fine? Exactly, exactly, right? <laughs> Eso sí nos aplica. <laughs> <laughs> y a pelearse con los de Tigo y los de Claro. Ok, ok, thank you. Um, let me see, Brenda, the next one. Married couples have more than five children. Oh, look at this one. Oh, this one is good. This one is good. Married couples, right? Yes. Mm -hmm. Los casados, right? Have more than five children. Ni casados, ni suerte. Okay. No. Uh, uh -huh. no married couples. <laughs> oh, okay. Not? No, a few married couples. Oh, no married couples. Oh, it's... Mm -hmm. oh, uh, a few. Few, few. few. okay, few. Few. 
few, Brenda. Yes. Few. Yes. Yes. Let me see. Married. Okay. Few married couples Couple. have more than five children. Oh. Yeah. Nowadays, nowadays, hoy en día, nowadays is it's like this one, right? Okay. Uh, what about how many brothers and sisters do you have, Erika? One. Oh, look at that one. That's impressive. Okay. What what about what about you, Arely? How many brothers and sisters do you have? Mm, four. <laughs> you four see? Brothers. Okay. Okay, so five. What about you, Hector? How many brothers and sisters do you have? Four, four brothers. Sorry. Three. Repeat. Oh, that's, that's question, very good, Arely. Yeah, right. So you have a lot of them. What about you, Hector? How many brothers and sisters do you have? Uh, uh, one sister. Oh, look at that one. Look at that one, people. Yes, young generation, right? They are just having like two or one children. Yes. Uh, but back in the days, they used to have a lot of children, right? Yeah, you see? And I love this thing about life. Pues cosas que se hacían en el pasado ya no se hacen anymore. Algunas cosas are good and some of them are not good, right? Yes. But I think in certain way, the things that are changing are good. You know what I mean? Y igual las leyes van cambiando, right? Here in El Salvador. Well, antes usted puede decir, los hombres podían decir un montón de piropos to ladies. Yes. On the street. Algunos de ellos eran not good, right? Yes. But nowadays, si alguien le tira un pilopo y usted se ofende, usted va y lo demanda, and I'm sorry for you. Lo puede meter a la cárcel. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> yes. Exactly. So that's the thing, right? Everything is changed, and somehow, in some ways, it's good. Teacher, yes. yo y el régimen, híjole. <laughs> ah, no. Ahí no lo defiende, Pat. <laughs> no, nobody. Nobody. Yes. Ni murmure. Ni nada, because mientras averiguamos, six months or a year. To, to six, months. Six, months. six months or a year. Yes. Y cuando sale, el gobierno no responde, right? I'm sorry for you. Como dice New York Marcos. I'm sorry for you. Yeah. It's, I don't care about you. Yes. Yes. Uh -huh. Yeah. So um, it's no difficult. Ni demandar al Estado. Exactly. Por eso, mire, los caballeros, right? Los, los que decían piropos ahora. Exactly. <laughs> Hasta por los chuchos, right? Just be careful with the chuchos. <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ. Okay, thank you. I'm sorry. Elderly people have part-time job. Elderly people. Look at, this is... Oh. What does it mean, elderly? Oh, people that is over 65. Um, People retire. Que ya se, se jubilaron, right? That's elderly people uh, yes it's all people elderly is all people all people oh. yes them? yes elderly people that is over 65 years old or okay. 60 mm -hmm. yes how part and job like uh this is like con este tipo de personas el, well los governments todos los governments son pero terrible okay uh, and and makes me sad when i talk about this situation con elderly people makes me sad después que uno le sirve al estado right al país después que llega una edad lo dejan de último and that is sad okay so what is the uh what is the um quantifier Pero aquí trabajan a tiempo completo, no medio tiempo. Oh, okay. <laughs> Casi mucho. Y si nos vamos al sector público. Oh, yes, exactly. So, a lot of, a lot of. A lot, a lot of. A lot okay, of. very good. Uh, students have full-time jobs. All, a lot of, few, most, nearly most. all. Most. Oh, okay, most. 
tal vez el, el, la, uni la universidad. Exactly. Ah, Full-time jobs. Okay. Or some. I think some. Que un montón de gente buscando empleos, right? Yes. yes. Some. And children okay. go to school on Saturday. <laughs> yeah, graduado no. de exactly. No. 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 Para, para llevarlos a clases de inglés, sí. Oh, yes. Not <laughs> all. Not all children go to school on Saturday. Sí, yo doy clases modalidades flexibles los días sábados y domingos. Entonces, sí, my, my students van Yo llevo a mi niña domingos. sábado a inglés también. Oh, that's very good. <laughs> Very good. Todo lo que usted invierta Ajá, en su bien. hijo o nieto, créame que le va a facilitar la vida en un futuro. Right? Sí, so, uh... sí yo la tengo en un programa de inglés en la US. Oh, that para is Para niños. Good. That is good. Mm. Okay. Thank you so much. Bueno, we finish. Okay, as you may see. Very good. Uh, let me see what else I have. Gracias you. por todo, teacher. Gracias por su paciencia, por ayudarnos mucho. Thank you so much. Ojalá, y ojalá nos volvamos a encontrar en otro curso. Oh, I hope so. Sí, I hope so. Okay. Yes. Yes, I hope Gracias so. por todo. Oh, thank you. Vamos a cantar la de Dora the Explorer, right? We did it. Okay. Gracias, teacher. Yes, no, un placer. La verdad que sí. We Los felicito it. a todos por su participación. Right? Uh, igual motivarlos a continuar. Yo les comentaba al principio, right, with Roxana, eh, okay. Vayan a pedir la visa, right? So you can go to New York and you yeah. can have Christmas Eve in oh, yeah. New, well, New Year's Eve in New York. Yes. So that's that's quite good. Sí, yo ya tengo la bendición de, de, hacer, de, de, de hacerlo hace mucho tiempo, Tich. Oh, y me good. siento como María para allá. No, so you can go over there and practice your English, right? Vaya and practice your English. Okay. Y me voy para, para el neighborhood donde solo latinos hay, right? Yeah. No, nadie habla inglés. Eh? Ok, solo hablan Spanglish. No, sí, felicitarlos a todos. Eh, les agradezco por, por su participación. Todos han sido uh, excelentes, right? Eh, e igual, invitarlos a siempre continuar. Eh, no se desanime. Yo sé que a veces por el trabajo, right? O a veces, pues... Por las diferentes circunstancias, uno se desanima y es uh, eh, seguir estudiando inglés, pero pues eh, motívese, right? practique en casa despacio, diga las frases, uh, ocúpelas, little by little. Igual, mire, hoy aprendimos qué significa eh, esa cosa de pastel. Venn <laughs> diagram. Exactly. No es un cake, right? No es un cake. So don't say that. Oh, it's cake diagram. <laughs> okay. Um, sí, so agradecerles a todos y felicitarlos. Uh, muchas gracias por su participación y pues espero verlos en un futuro, right? Allá gracias en New a usted, York. Gracias, teacher. En oh, New York. Gracias, teacher. Bendiciones. Oh, yeah. Thank you so much. Good night. Bye bye. Take care. Nice to meet you. Bye bye. My pleasure. Everybody. Thank you, teacher. Bye bye. Thank you so much for everything. Gracias por su momento de alegría. Gracias por aguantarme. Yes, I'm sorry. Gracias por aguantarme. You are a good teacher. Oh, thank you. Yes, thank you. Silvia, sí, Silvia, le tomé la asistencia. Don't worry. Luis uh -huh. también, ok, perfecto. good. So, yes. Oh, hoy ustedes van a salir, ¿verdad? Right? Ustedes pueden salir. Ya no voy a salir. Dice que si mucho se despide, no se quiere ir. Oh, Jesus. Another hour. Another hour. Thank you. Bye bye. Good night. Good night. Good night.